It's our first day out on the river in the spring 2021 wilderness guide training semester. Four days ago it was 29 degrees Fahrenheit and snowing like crazy. Today it's like mid 60s, 60s and the sun is shining and it's absolutely beautiful out. So it's still April, uh, April 29th. So April in northern Maine you can get days like this and you can get days where it's a blizzard. You just never know what you're gonna get. The only challenge for us today will be the wind because we're in big boats. The guys are in 18 foot boats with not a lot of weight in them and it's our first day off of the pond. So it might be a little challenging. By the end of the day, there'll be some frustration because of the wind. Uh, I'm in 20 foot Marge the Barge, my 20 foot Old Town XL Tripper today. Uh, great to be back in Marge the Barge for another season. And yeah, maybe you can hear that wind starting to pick up, but just stunningly beautiful out here. Wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Tim here at the field school. We're on the back side of Sam Squanch Island. And this little bit of quick water here, I call it Island Rips because it's on the other side of this island. Anyway, this is a fantastic place for learning how to pull in quick water. Because what we've got, if you look at it, is just this real short, only 10 feet or so long section of water. So when we'll pull up through this, but it's fast enough so that if you aren't aligned correctly with the current, you're gonna get spun. And that's the, uh, that's what we're trying to learn how to do. So when you're learning to pull or you're paddling in a big wind, it's a, it's a, it's a game of micro corrections. So if I'm coming straight up that current straight ahead, if I get more than about five degrees off to either side, then the current's gonna take me and spin me. So you gotta learn how to keep the boat as perfectly straight as you can. But this is why we're so fortunate here at the field school, because we've got all these awesome training locations literally right here. So that, on the other side of the water there, right over there, that's our property. So we're directly across the river. So. Stay tuned and see if there's any carnage here at Island Rips. All right, go ahead. So here Christopher's lining up for the vaunted Island Rips. There's a deep tongue of water right on shore over there. And notice he's hugging that. And just sneaks right up with the pole. You just couldn't do that with a paddle. You just couldn't. And that is Island Rips, and that's why the field, one of the reasons why the field school is awesome. We're supposed to get about an inch of rain overnight, which is gonna bring this water level right back up, and we'll be pulling this quite a bit. But again, we're on the backside of Sam Squanch Island here, so we can, uh, it's a great place to come out and do, do a trip around the island so you do laps we can do laps around the island and uh just a fun way to train fun way to practice 